Hello, this is Irie, and today we'll be talking about a how event that many people have expressed interest in, the Wind, Flower, Snow, Moon how event. And there are so many suits in this event, so let's get started right away. Um, the first suit we'll be talking about is the Wind suit. She comes with this background, and we'll go, we'll go find her right now. Look at her special pose first. This is, yeah, this is it. And um, her special pose comes all in one piece. No, which is not my personal favorite, but she is so cute, so I don't complain too much about it. And uh, she has this headdress as well as these magic circles, these books, and a really cute makeup. So we'll go into the view mode because I think a lot of people don't know just how far to the left her dress stretches. And there are a ton of detail on them too. Um, as well as the highlights on her hair. And this magic circle is also very useful. It's big and then you know you can rotate it to make it not look so tilted. Um, and then like put your Nikki on here so she looks like a mage. Um, yeah, as an anime fam, I really like these. I like the magic books as well. So that is the wind suit special pose. Um, the wind suit will probably be the first suit for many people to get just because the event currency for her has a higher drop rate than all the other kind of currencies for this event. And now we'll check out her normal pose. Um, this is her pigtail when they're not, you know, flying in the wind. The dress is actually really short, while, like, the long part is actually her coat. Good thing about the coat is that they're really lively colored um, and you know they look like candy pop colors right so she doesn't look too serious or heavy and then um, her hosiery these are shoes uh, headdress I, I guess this is more festive looking and then these candy looking makeups I personally really like her uh, bracelets these two because they're white and delicate looking and sometimes they're just the perfect accessories for outfits when you can't find anything else that matches. So that is the wind suit and the next one we'll be looking at is probably many people's favorite. This is the flower suit. Her full name is Flowers, a flower of the heart's kiss, yes. Um, and I've seen so many people asking about her. So here we go. This is her special pose. It is so sexy, so beautiful, even though it only comes in three piece. So um, there's not much, you know, you can change about it. You can change the hair and the makeup, but it is, it's just so pretty. Like I, I can um, just keep looking at her. And also I feel like her special pose goes well with pretty much any hair. You can just like slap them on. Um, as long as they don't look excessively young. Um, okay, maybe not these two. <laughs> but um, most hair generally works with a special pose. And um, so I think, I think a lot of people will like it when it comes to our server. And we'll go ahead and switch to a lighter background before we go into her normal pose. Just because there are a lot of parts that are red. If we keep that red background. Um, it might not show up as well and one thing i didn't forget to mention that 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 red background it has like those swirling rose petal effects too which i personally really like and now we're on her normal pose and she has many more parts here this black hair is really well done i think like you can see like these detailed tresses her dress is not as extravagant as you know the special pose but it can even pass for a wedding dress if you want it and i love these red ribbons i use them so much just because like the red color is it's really nice but it doesn't hurt your eyes and then she also comes with these sexy garters shoes, um, roses petal, rose petals on the ground, and um, a flower. It's called, you know, crown of the flowers, kiss, but it looks more crystal-like. And then earrings, um, the necklace that are like blood red color beads. She also holds roses, and then those are her right hand makeup. 
no, not makeup. Sorry, bracelet. She also comes with these tattoos. I love these tattoos. Um, because look, there's one rose here, and then there are more on her ankles. So yeah, I think those are you know some tattoos. They look uh, in Nikki. They look a little bit too fantasy like, but these I think a lot of people you know they will maybe even be willing to get these in real life. And now of course the makeup is super awesome. She looks. You know, alluring and sexy without looking too old. So that is the flower suit. I'm always, always impressed when I see her. And next, let's talk about the moon suit. She is a stark contrast with、um, the flower suit, but I think she is beautiful as well. We'll find her background first. This is the moon suit's background. And check out her special pose. Take everything off. So as you can already see, that this Sue has the biggest hair <laughs> in the game. Like there are hair waterfalls, so, which I actually learned to understand a little bit because you know her, like this suit itself is really really big.、Um, and funny story about this suit is that you know it's a huge suit, so you need like a big hair to offset it. But people always make fun of it. And they also make fun of the special pose itself because they say that it looks pregnant, and that just makes me feel really bad for the artist because they put in so much work in it. Even though you know I can see where people are coming from, but、um, you know, like to this day, to this day, that this suit is still kind of has a meme status on and on the Chinese server. Even though everyone loves her as well, like they use her parts all the time, but. Anyways, I'm rambling on. <laughs> These are her shoes. They're like a really fancy cloud style shoes.、Um, she has these flowers accessories too on her ha hair as well, and then you know another headdress. And these background flowers will probably be your new favorite items in competition because they just legit block everything. And anything <laughs> that are on the screen,、um, yeah, they're used a lot、um, on the Chinese server for both corridor and competitions. And I, you know, I like them as well. Not because they block people, but because of how much、um, details there are. You know, it's just a mysterious purple color, but there are enough glitters on them to make them look ethereal at the same time. And again, the suit itself just has. So much going on for it. Like you can just stare at it and not get bored, <laughs> because like all of these、um, intricacies. So that is the moon suit special pose. We will do her normal pose next. Here we go. The normal pose. It's her hair is still really big and long,、um, and we do get her dress as a separate part. The rest comes with the coat, and I do wish they separated out these flowing ribbons into maybe like a brooch or even you know a scarf, but、um, they didn't. So there's that. We have these shoes.、Um, they're the same ones as the special pose ones. These flowers too. But she does get these、um, side decorations on,、um, like as part of her normal pose suit, and then the bracelet, and of course this makeup. That just reminds me so much of Kimmy. I love it. And shout out to my friend Moon. Um, thank you so much for always checking up on me. Like, I really love the suit, and I think you know she is the perfect match for you too. I can't wait for you to get the suit on our server and put the sapphire makeup on it. So yeah. Um, and okay, let's look at the snow suit now. <laughs> Now that I like confess my love for my friend, <laughs> the snowsuit is、um, probably the hardest to get for the event、um, because of her abysmal drop rate, like the abysmal drop rate of her event currency. This is her special pose, and when we use her background, that you can you can see her、um, reflections on the ice too, and. Uh, she is so like just so grand, and、um, 
very very like when when she first came out i think i think a lot of people on the chinese server were, were super impressed like they were helping on getting her um and I'm gonna show her parts really quick. Okay, so um, her special pose is, you know, this one thing again. I think that's pretty common for this event, but I love her eyes accessories. The headdress is, is so detailed. Looks like it's like sculpted out of eyes and crystals too. And then there's these like, you know, her breasts comes with as a, I think, face accessory, if I remember correctly. I think that's like adds a touch of realism to her because, you know, it's she's in a cold environment and then that's her sleepy makeup. I love these um, back items. Is it back? Back or wings? And I actually use them in my avatar as well. So, um, that is the special pose. Um, her normal pose, I won't talk about it because it's really special this time um, because of this tail it's a legit mermaid tail probably the only real mermaid tail in game because ironically the tail from the mermaid hell event um, that I talk about in another video is part of a dress so this is the actual mermaid tail um, and um you know here we go her dressed again and then these eyes uh, decorations we get her makeup i mean sorry necklace now too then these wheels of eyes on her back she also comes with another makeup and uh i can't remember <laughs> this is one of my favorite makeups i i use it so much that you know um because it's you know the her pupil is like her pupils are lightly colored and um, so they don't really distract from whatever hair color you pick for her and I want to point out that mermaid tail thing I was talking about so um, this this is a mermaid hell event tail so as you can see it's actually a dress and this is the snow suits mermaid tail and you can see here there are actually two versions and the developers I think in this case were super thoughtful because you get a bottoms version, so this is a bottom piece, and you also get like a shoes version. So for the shoes version, you can put a dress on her and use this tail too, whereas the bottom version, if you want, you can put a top on her. And this, if I recall, it was mailed to us, I think, rather than part of the completion. Um, it, it's been a while, but um, I'm assuming we'll get both versions on our server too. So that is the snowsuit. Um, her background has these like shiny floating sparks too. And now we will go on to see the minor suits of the event. So um, what's different from all of the other videos that I made on the How event is that this the minor suits for this event, they have so many <laughs> recolors. Uh, okay, first up is this suit that I'm still missing this part in. I've said that so many times, but you know, it, it, it's cute. I think um, kind of more of a contrast to the uh, more gorgeous and elegant suits that we have as the new suit. Um, and then like, you know, she has an, a hand instrument as well and then, you know, nice white hair. So that is the first minor suit, the bell chimes in the wind. I, I don't know, maybe I don't like to talk about it too much, like Psycho maybe because psychologically I know I'm missing something from it. Um, this is her recolor. So yeah, as you can see, I, I have this coffee, but, um, nothing else. Not, not the other one. So. Um... Yeah, I think I think this one's okay, personally. It's like the dress you will have to spe specially coordinate colors to match it. And then the next minor suit is flower poem poems of flowery love. Okay, it's a bad translation. <laughs> um, this is. Of the I guess a pigeon style suit for this event and um, it's, it's, it's well made like a lot of pigeon suits you know a lightly lavender dress 
with um, shoes and then fancy hat, um, fans, gloves, uh, earrings, and then necklaces. Nothing too outrageous, but you know, um, these can be really useful when you coordinate them with other items. And we'll check out her recolors too. So I'm kind of going fast now just because like I don't want to drag this video out too long. Um, the darker recolor is... I feel like we need more dresses of this color. <laughs> it's just such an elegant blue. So shoes, again hat, and um, basically pretty much like everything here is like now in this recolor. So that is the second minor suit. Now the third one is I think a little bit different, not what people would expect. This is Nostalgia of the Snowy Plain. So a North suit, actually, North suit, yes. And um, I actually really like this one because you know her hair is really cute um, and the short hair, we, I've always, I'm always looking for good short hair and then her cape. And top and bottom, they like they go really well with any military style outfits that you want to make. And I, I think you know we just recently got the St. Patrick's Day suit, so maybe you can coordinate some of the green items in there with this suit too. And the really nice hat and just a cute. Um, it's actually called Mail Ticket of Youth, is what her <laughs> purse is called. Uh, that is the original color. Um, the recolor is more white looking. So, yeah, and you know, pink short hair, um, white and blue items that can be really flexible again for more masculine looks. Shoes, hat. Um, yeah, I'm so I was surprised because I didn't anticipate how much I would like this minor suit even though you know it looks really it looks small in comparison to others on the posters but i'm glad i got her and last but not least we will look at the egyptian themed suit so yeah this is the samsara of the moon's shadow is what she is called so many parts um i think she will go really well with the soul prophet items that we got from the Black Rose event on our server already. Um, very intricate looking, you know, she even has a mask and these um, veils. Veils? Yeah. Um, necklace? Uh, further? I think this will be a scarf, right? Don't remember the part designations. Um, bracelets, then a long staff. Like this, you can, you know, um, barring any cultural significance that staff I feel like you can use it in other occasions too and she also comes with the recolors too I was impressed that this one had a recolor as well just because you know like it was already really well put together and um, like hair is now more blonde color this is the same one as the original color and I think the top and the bottom too but the mask changed color here the mask and the hair um, everything else. Oh, the tail too. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we get more tails. We. That's good, right? Because right now, I feel like our tails options are more spread out. Like, they're either wings or they are super fancy fox tails. So, to have something more streamlined, like this one, I think will be a great addition to our wardrobe. And, um, yeah, so those are the major and the minor suits for the wind flower snow moon effect um, effect <laughs> event this event is also commonly known as the four elements event just because that name is shorter and um, i normally like to talk about the lore behind um, all the suits but i think that would risk making this video becoming too long because i think we're ready at maybe 15 20 minutes so I'm planning to do the lore in a separate video instead. There are four stories to each suit and each one of them is very interesting. They actually involve characters we already know from the story and some of them are like, I, I'm an absolute favorite, I adore them. So I can't wait to talk about them in the next video and 
Um, thank you as always for supporting uh, my small channel and I really appreciate all the kind comments and encouragements that everyone leaves. So thank you so much again. I'll catch you next time.